You're now tuned into Kofi's Universe since you're just sitting on Uranus. This is the number one YouTube channel for hip hop culture news, informed black social issues, song reaction videos, and even comedy. So be sure to like this post. And if you haven't already subscribed, do so right about now. Razzcast. YouTube salute. 50 Cent has once again taken aim at Rick Ross after he was filmed getting jumped by Drake supporters in Canada. If you're new to my channel, thumbs up the video, hit that sub button, click that bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. So footage of Rosé's performance at Ignite Music Festival in Vancouver on Sunday, June 30th showed him and his entourage being confronted by a group of men backstage for playing Kendrick Lamar's They Not Like Us, They Not Like Us doing a set. So I saw the footage on IG. It's only like no more than Eight seconds, five seconds. I wasn't gonna play because I don't want nobody. Excuse me. I don't want YouTube giving me a copyright strike if I got one already last year, and I ain't going through that shit again. But anyway, though, after the two camps exchanged words, um, Rick Ross was sucker punched in the face by one of the men, leading to a all-out brawl that lasted for several minutes. Um, Rick Ross' crew appeared to have come out worse with multiple members of his team being knocked to the floor and badly beaten down. So Ross, meanwhile, seemingly managed to escape. Um, he, um, he just had a sucker punch, whatever. I guess he wasn't, you know, beat up um, that bad or, or, you know, bruised up. And he fled the scene and got, on the, um, got out of there. So never one to pass up an opportunity to troll 50 Cent, here he comes, and he actually put up this on social media, laughing my ass off, crying face emoji, the great escape. Mika called the chasers. They are chasing me. <laughs> this dude always saying something, but 50 Cent actually said something about the footage, and um, we're going to play this, y'all. Let's listen to this, all right? Hey, guys, you know, I just saw... Uh, uh very unfortunate situation that took place in Canada. And I want to say to everyone, you know, that I, um, I hope that that brother made it home safely. I hope that uh, he now has a different perspective and a better sense of what to do and what not to do while you're out in the world, you know? Um, that part where the, 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 the young guy went like, he did this little move and shit and got knocked the fuck out, like right there. That was not, that does not reflect him. That reflects his camp. And he might need to go get the uh, the Dream Chasers or um, <laughs> the 305 Killers. <laughs> hey guys, you know, I just saw. All right, y'all, y'all heard 50 Cent. That <laughs> fool crazy, man. But um, as far as Rick Ross, you need to um, get better security, man. Ain't no way your security and your entourage are supposed to be getting knocked out like that. I'm just being real. Like, you got those dudes on a payroll for what? Like, you don't got no professional bodyguards. I'm talking about people that know, like, Brazilian jiu-jitsu, kickboxing, um, Jeet Kundo, you know, mixed martial artists. You don't got no people you can't... I know you got money. You should be... You're supposed to be having like some former Navy SEALs, former Airborne Rangers type of people, some assassin dudes. Like, if they come up on you, they can fight 20 people by themselves. That's the type of people you should be paying for. But, you know, at the end of the day, everybody know about Drake and Rick Ross, their little situation that happened a month or two ago. Actually, damn, three months ago. Damn, time is fine. It's July 1st. But we all know about that. Okay, that's one thing. Two, how long, how long, I'm just saying, like, is this going to last as far as Rick Ross? Um, you got to know that this come with the territory. You know, Drake, you know, stands. They did exactly what they were supposed to do. They're going to defend Drake, regardless if he's right or wrong. I mean, will Rick Ross fans stand up for um, him if Drake was like in Atlanta, Georgia or Florida? Mm, I highly doubt it. Not like that. I'm just saying Drake ain't stupid. He going to have he going to have the security around him, but that would have never happened to some real people that really know what's going on. Like you would have never saw that happen to no Pusha T. You would have never seen that happen to no K-Dot. 
You see what I'm saying? So, no, nah, but um, that didn't even happen to Meek Mill when he was beefing with Drake. You see what I'm saying? But like I said, but Meek Mill, he ended up going to jail, back to jail, and got out. Anyway, though, but um, y'all let me know what you think. Post your comments below. Post smash Black Panther the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. You want to support, donate to the channel. I have Patreon. Patreon.com slash Kofi Universe. Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Streamlabs. Everything's in the description. Until next time, salute.